In this video, we'll be using a simple technique for multicolor 3D printing to make an American flag in celebration of Independence Day. First, we'll need to find an image of an American flag, which was really easy and is in the public domain, so we won't have to worry about any licensing rules. We're downloading the SVG vector file, which should be perfect for importing into 3D modeling software. In Fusion 360, we'll start a new sketch, then insert SVG and select the file. SVGs don't often come in scaled correctly, so we'll scale it down to 0 0.0075 times its original size, leaving a final width right around 150 millimeters. Also, enough stars didn't import and a few changes had to be made to the original sketch, but the process of making all those modeling changes would have been a little too much to put in this video. Now that we have our set model, we can get to printing. I managed to get some of the printing on time-lapse, but these prints require a lot of hands-on attention to work correctly. There are three files, one for each color, and the model is set to be one layer thick, enabling us to print each color and leave it on the build plate to print the other colors in sequence. Here's what it looks like after the white layer, red layer, and blue layer. It's important to have a very well calibrated machine and a level build plate. I'd recommend a razor blade to carefully scrape the 3D printed flag off of the build plate. Now let's model the flagpole. It was designed to be mostly hollow so that by increasing the infill, the bottom portion will be heavier than the rest of the model and sit nicely when printed. After the flagpole is printed, the flag will slide into the slot on the side of the flagpole, leaving us with our finished product. Thank you so much for watching! Make sure to check the description for links to the files on Thingiverse and more details and photos on Instructables.